Good morning, everybody. More hymns this morning. <laughs> I have uh, one here for a dear friend in America and another one for a dear friend in Australia, the first two. So the first one is sowing in the morning, sowing seeds of kindness, sowing in the noontide and the dewy eve, waiting for the harvest and the time of reaping. We shall come rejoicing, bringing in the sheaves. The second one is you have longed for sweet peace and for faith to increase. You have earnestly, fervently prayed, but you cannot have rest or be perfectly blessed until all on the altar is laid. Is your all on the altar of sacrifice laid? Your heart does the spirit control. You can only be blessed and have peace and sweet rest as you yield him your body and soul. Second two, um, there's only two more. <laughs> the third one is, uh, there is a name I love to hear. I love to sing its worth. It sounds like music in my ear, the sweetest name on earth. Oh, how I love the Saviour's name. Oh, how I love the Saviour's name. Oh, how I love the Saviour's name, the sweetest name on earth. The precious name of Jesus. And the fourth one, last one, out of my bondage, sorrow and night. 
Jesus, I come, Jesus, I come. Into thy freedom, gladness and light, Jesus, I come to thee. Out of my sickness, into thy health. Out of my want and into thy wealth. Out of my sin and into thyself, Jesus, I come to thee. satisfying when the last run hits on the right note at the right time <laughs> now I've got a lovely little bit of the Bible here to read so Jesus I come to thee and of course one of the most beautiful and much loved verses in the Bible is John 3 16 so I'm going to read from uh, verse 14 John 3 14 and as Moses lifted up the servant in the wilderness, even so must the Son of Man be lifted up, that whosoever believeth in him should not perish, but have eternal life. For God so loved the world that he gave his only begotten Son, that whosoever believeth in him should not perish, but have everlasting life. For God sent not his Son into the world to contemn the world, but that the world through him might be saved. So God bless you all today. <laughs> See you next Sunday. Goodbye.